Hello everyone, welcome to Tutorials Point. In this video, we are going to learn about surface area and volumes. In our previous classes, we have derived different formulas to find out surface area and volumes of different three-dimensional basic objects like cube, pyramid, cylinder and cone. First of all, let's understand what is surface area. The surface area of three-dimensional shape is the sum of all the surface area of each of the sides. It means that while we calculating surface area, we are concerned about only the outer layer of object. For example, if you take a cube, if you want to find out surface area of cube, first we have to find out area of each of the side, then we have to combine them, that will become surface area of cube. It means that we are not considering the inner portion of cube. Coming to the volume, the volume is a measure of how much space an object takes up. It means that while we calculating volume, we are considering the whole portion of object. If you take an example again, the complete space occupied by this cube is called volume of cube. In this world, we have different objects. And there are some objects which are combination of basic three-dimensional shapes. Here I have collected few objects. Let's find out what kind of shapes hidden in it. We'll begin with this tanker truck. If you observe this tank, it is in this shape. If you divide this tank into different parts, you'll get one hemisphere, one cylinder, and again another hemisphere. If you combine them, Again, it looks like a tank. If you observe this circus tent, you will find two basic shapes. Can you find out what are they? The upper portion looks like a cone and downward portion looks like a cylinder. If you combine them, it looks like a tent again. Not only these objects, even smaller one like ice cream, test tube. Let's find out what kind of shapes in them. If you observe this complete ice cream outer layer, it looks like it has two basic shapes. The upper portion resembles a hemisphere and downward portion looks like a cone. If you combine them, again it resembles ice cream. Coming to the test tube, it is a combination of cylinder and a hemisphere. This downward portion resembles this hemisphere. Not only these objects, even architecture, for example, this pyramid and different buildings. If you see this pyramid, it is in pyramid shape only. Pyramid shape itself a basic three-dimensional shape. Coming to this building, the upper portion looks like a cone and this downward portion resembles a cylinder. Likewise, the remaining parts. So guys, in this video, we have seen that there are different objects in this world which are combination of basic three-dimensional shapes. So in upcoming videos, we are going to solve different problems based on this concept. Tutorialspoint.com Simply easy learning.